You've already met him, but he's back. Founder and president of the Invisible Disabilities Association, the one, the only, Mr. Wayne Cannell. Well, I met my wonderful wife, Sherry, sitting right back here. Um, I met her in 1992, and she had already been diagnosed with progressive MS. That's the kind that doesn't have good days. We met in 92, and in 92, she was diagnosed with Lyme disease. And if, if you know what Lyme disease is from a tick, and it's a little creature that decides to destroy your body. Well, we can determine that back when she was 14 years old is when she, uh, she was bitten by a tick. We got married in 94. People ask me, you married her knowing she was ill? I said, you would have mar- if you would have known her, you would have married her too. I mean, what an amazing lady. So finally, half the brain she has. Well, in 97, we launched our first website, invisibledisabilities.org, because we wanted people to just understand when you can't see that it's real. And Sherry coined the phrase back in 1996. She said, you know, people just don't know me. They can't tell. They don't know that I was an actress and a singer and a dancer. They can't tell by looking at me. So we put it online, and it went crazy. We had no idea there were people all over the world that were dealing with the same thing. And sometimes their family members didn't understand it, especially when the doctors can't find a diagnosis and it goes on and on and on. And people feel like they're, uh, they're lost. We have family members that we get stories and people, they're told they're being just being lazy or they're just making it up because nobody really can be that sick. But these are people that maybe for 35, 40 years have been healthy, then all of a sudden they're not. And so... We want to reach out to them. We wrote a little book called But You'll Look Good. Um, you can fix them up on your way out if you'd like to purchase one tonight. A um, little 60-page book. We've sent 16,000 of these around the world just from our website. You can't get them anywhere else right now. And we've had husbands with them on their pillow. We had a couple from New Zealand, and the husband read it straight away. And he brought his wife tea in bed the next morning. He got it. We see that happening a lot. See mothers with their adult daughters who get it. They read the book. It's it's amazing. We had no idea. People order 30 at a time, and they send them to all their friends and family, hoping that they'll get it. 